while you're in the first five seconds of the video, go ahead, like and subscribe. God told you above all people. Bring it out. God told you above all people. God told you above all people. Hey, brother. God told you above all people. You don't know that. You don't know that. We carry ourselves like niggas. We carry ourselves like fox. Like jump offs. Like hood rats. That's right. You don't know that we're above all people. Bring hey, it out. You're the most beautiful thing on the earth. God chose you. Doing good, doing good. What we want to, what we want to out here. Man, I, look, I'm trying to, you know what I'm saying, get a phone in. Yeah. Take a look at them signs right there, bro. The Romans, chapter 13 and verse 11. And then knowing the time, that now is high time to awake out of sleep. For now is our salvation nearer than when we believe. We've been watching stuff going on on the news. Yeah. I read it again. Because our people are like, look, read it again. And then knowing the time. Right now, knowing the time. The time is going on in this world right now. 
all the stuff that's going on in these other countries, the dollar is about, the dollar, uh, uh, the uh, value of the dollar is, 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 is declining, uh, food prices is going up. Hey, we. And now it is high time to awake out of sleep. Now it's high time to awake out of sleep. Because this ain't no, no, uh, no, no, you know he's Israel, right? Has he been telling you that you're Israel? Sir, sir. But the thing is, he can't trust the Moses. He can't just recognize who he is. Give me out there, man. He recognizes who he is. Look, look, how old you is? Sir, I don't need to. My name is Dr. Jesus. That's why. All right, so back in the days, right, they called us a uh, uh, couple. And then from couple, it went to Negroes, right? From Negroes, it went to uh, Afro American. That's a hair stack, right? And then from Afro-American, it went to uh, black. And now we call ourselves African-American. What's our true national We're the Israelites, but our people don't know that, right? Because we done went through all these different nationalities. But we're still one nation. How we got different nationalities as one nation? Read this here. The book of Isaiah, chapter 1 and verse 3. The ox knows his owner, and he asks his master's crib. But Israel do not know. My people do not consider. The ox knows its owner. So an ox, that's an animal that's used to farm. You know, it's a stubborn animal. When it says the ox was left, the ox what? Know his owner. The ox knows his owner. So he'll come up to his owner and get out his hand because he knows his owner. Read. And the ass, his master's crib. The ass is a jackass. That's a stubborn ass animal. It's hard as hell to get the animal to do something, right? But the Bible says, what? Well, and the ass his master's crib. He knows his master's crib. You can take this ass all the way to the west side of Chicago and drop it off. You know what? It'll find its way right back here because he knows his master's crib. So the Bible is comparing the Israelites to an ass, which is a stubborn ass animal, and an ox, which is another stubborn ass animal. But Israel doth not know. But Israel what? Doth not know. Does not what? Doth not know. That's why we're African-American, Afro-American, right. we colored, black, all these different titles. Because we don't know. Come on. My people doth not consider. They don't even consider. Have we ever considered what's our true nationality? Because uh, uh, Reverend Jesse Jackson, he the one coined African-American in the 80s. I'm older than that. How do you think about Bring it out. No. No. That's crazy. We don't consider. But a lot of our people want to walk around here and say we won't. What do you want to? Right. We don't even know who we are as a people. Bring it out. That's right. We can't come together on nothing. The west side hates the south side. South side hates the east side. And everybody hates the north side. Right. We can't come together. There's nothing. Because we don't know who I am, who we are. Keep reading though. And a sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity. A sinful nation. We a sinful nation, bro. We the murder capital of America. The murder capital of America. They call it Chirac. You know what they do in Iraq? They kill on a regular basis. They got warlords. Everybody walk around with AKs and kill anybody that don't go to jail. That's what they label this here city as a third world country. Meaning third world countries, man, there's no law. There's nothing here. You can read. A seed of evildoer. A seed of evildoer. Because our parents ain't been taught how to really treat us, how to love us, how to raise us up right. Shit. You got fathers who gave babies, and what they do, they pass on that tradition to their kids. Or you got the daddy he did, or he in jail, and the mother, she go get with a guy just like him. So what's happened to our seeds? Read it again. Children. And a seed of evildoers! A seed of evildoers! You got 10 and 12 year olds jumping out of the car with drums. The switch is on. Hello. Come on Those over here, sir. Killing innocent, innocent babies. Bro, they killing the women now. It used to be back in the days, there was a rule that you only told the man that was in the game. Now, ain't no rules no more. Get that in uh, Oh, who's that for? Ain't no rules. There's no rules no more. There's no rules, there's no love for one another, but we used to have a, do you remember, we used to have block parties. The whole block come out of the bar, you can't do that no more out here. You can, you start a block party, where it's gonna be shot up. It's gonna be 
Shut up. Read that. The book of Hosea, chapter 4 and verse 1. Hear the word of the Lord, ye children of Israel. For the Lord hath the controversy against the inheritance of the land. So God has a controversy with us. Which is so called black. Bring it out. If you got your kids, I say you got kids and they don't miss it. You're going to be mad and say you're going to discipline them, right? That's what's happening with us. That's why we're at the bottom of society. That's why we're the last hire in the first fire. They look at our applications to see our crazy names. I know he's black. Look at the name. You ain't even got to look down to the ethnicity. I know he's black. His name is Ray Quad or Tyson. We put names together and make a name. That's an astonishment, bro. Read. Because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of God in the land. There's no mercy amongst us. Man, we, we, we'll kill somebody for stepping on our shoes. We'll kill somebody for looking at our girl, right. for looking at her. We'll kill somebody for looking at you walking down the street, bro. There's no mercy in this land because there's no knowledge of God. You are God, bro. Right. Did you know that? You ever heard that? You ever heard that? Oh God, get that. The Bible says oh God, bro. That's why your cousin, he woke up. He woke up to who he truly is. You know what I'm saying? And that's what we out here trying to do, wake up our people up so we can come together, man, and get up out of this, this wickedness that we in, man. Stop the drug dealing and the game banging in our communities, man. Read. The book of Psalms, chapter 82, and verse 6. I have said, ye are God. You hear that, bro? Read it again. I have said, ye are God. So the most high God says that you're so called black. You are God. That's what? You are God on this earth. You are God. But because you refuse to follow his ways, this is what's going to happen to us. Come on. And all of you are children of the most high. Read. What? You shall die like men. You shall what? Die like men. You shall what? Die like men. So we gonna die like any other man on this earth. Because there's no truth in this man. Now go back. We gonna die because there's no truth in this man and no knowledge of God. Let's go back and read that. Book of Hosea, chapter 4 and verse 1. Hear the word of the Lord. So God said, hear the word. Hear the word of the Lord. So-called black man, black man, Native American. Hear the word of the Lord, which is in the Bible. Read. Ye children of Israel. Ye children of Israel. For the Lord has the controversy with the inhabitants of the land. God is mad at us. Why are you bringing so much murder in our neighborhood? God is mad at us. Because we will not hearken unto his word. Read. Because there is no truth. There is no law. Come on. No mercy. There is no mercy amongst each other. We can't stand one another. Black on black. Hispanic on black, Hispanic on Hispanic, free. No knowledge. No knowledge with the God's laws. There's none of God's laws in this world. There's none of God's laws in our communities. That's why we hate one another. That's why we kill one another. That's why we sell drugs to one another. And now this land, the legalized marijuana, so they can sell it to us to help destroy us. And we want to still follow it. Free. Bring it out. No knowledge of God in the land. Come on. By swearing and lying and killing swearing and lying and killing that's all we do to one another we want to sleep with our each another man wife we want to sleep with another man uh, a, a woman wants to sleep with another man husband right. lying we don't care about one another we hate one another read and committing adultery committing adultery come on and they break out and blood touches blood and they break out that man come on catch his wife in the field another man blood gonna touch blood he's gonna put him to death that's why there's no knowledge in our land. We got to go back to God's laws. We're the greatest people ever walked the earth. The greatest. We're the best at everything. But yet we're at the bottom of society. We can't stand one another. We. Get out. Therefore, shall the land mourn. We. And everyone that dwells therein shall languish with the beast of the field. The beast of the field. So called white man, and we love man up with them. We choose the white woman over the black woman. She's the most beautiful thing on the earth. The black woman chooses the white man over the, over the black man. He's the greatest thing ever walked the earth. Read. And with the fall of the heavens, yea, 
the fishers of the sea also shall be taken away. Come on. Yet let no man strive, nor reprove another, for thy people are as the strive with the priest. Jump down to six. Verse six. My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. So God says, Bring it out. His people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. That lack of knowledge is celebrating Mother's Day. What? Because that's not on the Bible. That lack of knowledge is selling on the Sabbath day because that's against God's law. That lack of knowledge is doing anything that's against the Bible because we ain't been taught in the church. That's we right. Out the church. Free. Because thou hast rejected knowledge. I will also reject thee! So God said, because we reject his knowledge, we're going to reject us. How did God reject us? Wow! He put us at the bottom of society. He put us in the worst living conditions. He gave us the worst food. A lot of our same neighborhoods, water was messed up. We get the worst of everything that God reject us because we reject him. We got to come back to God's law and take the command. We need That's you. Right. My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge! Hey, sir, did you know that the knowledge of God's talking about his law? We, we are destroyed because we don't know God's law. You can ask God, people, give us one law. Give me one law. Thou shalt not kill is the law. If we apply that, our communities will change. Thou shalt not steal. Come in. We That's need to right. come back. Read. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee. So God has rejected us, so-called black man, Hispanic man, your God on the earth. So God has rejected us. Because we reject him. Right. Hey, sir, you know your Israelite going to the Bible? You guys told the people, we the greatest thing ever walked on the earth. Right. I say that because it's in the Bible. If we were made in the image of our God, that means we God. Right. Give me Deuteronomy 6 and 7. 6 and 7, is that what I want? 7 and 6, see that? Because we don't even know who we are. Our ox and the ass know who they, who they own and master is. We don't even know our true nationality. That's right! And we go with that. We walk around and we go with that. Everything is good, not knowing who you are. We, the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7 and verse 6. For thou art a holy people. So God said to a holy people, black man, holy means separate. He separated you from everybody else. And he'll tell you, come on. Unto the Lord thy God. Read. The Lord thy God had chosen thee. He chose you, black man, Hispanic man. That's right. You. Read. To be a special people. A what? A special people. A what? A special people. A special people. He says you're a special people to God. We don't know that. We don't know that. Brother, you're a special people to God. But we don't know that. Read. Unto himself. Unto himself. Then he separated us. He made us. He made everybody else. He said, y'all my special people. Come to me. Come to me. Read. Above all people. Above what? All people. Above what? All people. There's no equality. We have been made to be above all people. Look in space. We're above all people. That's right. Where we're at. Come on. Above all people that are above the face of the earth. Above the face of the earth. We're above all people on the face of the earth. But why are we at the bottom of society? Why? Why are we at the bottom of society? Because we refuse to keep God's laws, that's the commandment. We refuse to obey our God. The only one true living God. But yet, here we is. We want to celebrate Mother's Day. Right. We want to celebrate anything that our oppressors give us. We want to celebrate, hey, hey, you going to celebrate Mother's Day? Celebrate Mother's Day, Mom? Mother's Day ain't in the Bible. Mother's Day is a good God. Right. When you celebrate this in this world, you, you're an enemy of God. Did you know that, sis? Did you know that? Anything that's against God, you, you make yourself an enemy of God. Going to church on Sunday, you make yourself an enemy of God. Read it again from the top. For thou are an holy people. So God said, you black Hispanics are a holy people. Come on. Unto the Lord thy God. Come on. The Lord thy God had chosen thee to be a special people. He told you to be a special people. A special people. So when you become special, that means you got rules. Right. You got a special pair of shoes. You don't treat it like you want to go to. That's you right. 
You got a special outfit that you like wearing. You put it up. You do it differently. You don't want that in the gym. You take it to the trailer. Breathe. On to himself. Above all people. Above all people. God told you above all people. God told you above all people. Bring it out. God told you above all people. Hey, brother. God told you above all people. You don't know that. You don't know that. We carry ourselves like niggas. We carry ourselves like fox. Like jump offs. Like hood rats. That's right. You don't know that we're above all people. Bring hey, it brother. out. You're the most beautiful thing on the earth. God told you, read it again. For thou art. Hey, or, hey, 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 for thou art in holy people unto the Lord thy God. The Lord thy God has chosen me to be a special people. God told you to be a special people, sis. So when you special, you gotta do things that's special. You gotta do things that's different than the rest of this world. You can't follow the world because the world ain't special to God. Free unto himself above all people. He said, that's the right. The are above all people. But why we at the bottom of society, sis? Why? Don't nobody want to answer that question. Because everybody good with being at the bottom. Right. I ain't good with being at the bottom going up a down on her. That's, That's right. right. I ain't good at being at the bottom. I ain't, hey, I'm not good with my people living the way they live. I'm not good with that. That's so right. None of us be good with that. None of us. And until we learn who we are and come back to God's laws, we going to stay at the bottom. That's right. We're going to stay at the bottom as long as we sell it on the Lord's back. We're going to stay at the bottom as long as we end up another man of religion. We're going to stay at the bottom. I do not understand that. Give me Deuteronomy 28, 15. I'm going to show you why we're at the bottom of society. I'm going to show you why we're the last, last high and the first fire. I'm going to show you why we got the worst school conditions. I'm going to show you why we got the worst living conditions. Read. Look at Deuteronomy 10 and 28 and verse 15. Come on. But it shall come to pass. If thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe, to do all his commandments. But it shall come to pass. If thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe, to do all his commandments. Hey, brother, you hear that? The Bible says we have to hearken. We have to listen to the word of God and do all his commandments, bro. If we did that, we would be on top of the world. That's right. But right now, since we don't want to do that, we at the bottom. We at the bottom, bro. We like we like the concrete and the white man walking over us. That's where we are. Yeah. We're the dirt and the earth and the water. The white man walking all over us because we don't know who we are. Read. And the statue, which I commanded in this day. Come on. That all these curses. All these what? All these curses. All these what? All these curses. Hey, sis. Did you know we under the curses right now? Hey, sis, just cross the street. Read. Shall come upon thee and overtake thee. All these curses don't come upon us and overtake us. What is a curse? A curse is a terrible thing. Hey, sis, did you know a curse is a bad thing, right? Hey, sis, give me two minutes. Come over here. Let me show you something. Let me show that you're one of the great, you're a great thing ever living, sis. That's right. We can't even see it in ourselves. We look in the mirror and we see a jump off, we see a thought, we see a hood rat, we see a nigger. We don't see greatness in ourselves when we look at ourselves. You know. That's why we hate one another, because we hate ourselves. What is nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. 